Hey guys, welcome back to Charles and Alyssa forever. forever. Today we have another mukbang for y'all. Mm -hmm. We got crab. Yep. We got lobster. lobster up in this thing this time. We got shrimp and we got some corn. And I got some um, sausages. And we got sushi in the back playing with some paper. She's making some noise, so if you hear anything, it's her. We're sorry. So if you're new to the channel, please make sure you guys subscribe right now. Um, I'm so hungry. As y'all know, we like doing like little mugs. We like things. eating <laughs> and talking. We figured since we like eating seafood a lot, we might as well make more videos and just sit there and talk. Cause I don't know if y'all know, Alyssa is a talker. Charles is a talker. I think you talk more. Um, not when I'm eating. Cause I like, I'm starving right now. I haven't had anything to eat all day. Neither have you. Yeah, we've been waiting on you. We've been waiting. And I woke up kind of late today. Yeah. We had a little episode last night. So we were up all night. Alyssa got hurt doing a TikTok. Stupid. I know, I know that's what the comments are going to be like, you're uh, stupid. Yeah, the comments are going to be like, what are you, retarded? <laughs> I want to know if anyone else has done that TikTok specifically, if they got hurt. Explain to them what the TikTok was. So it was like a... Oh my God, it's so good. A girl on, on a broom, like a witch. And like, you have to stand on something to make it look like you're actually like floating mm -hmm. on the broom. And so... We used a tub, that didn't work. Uh -huh. It wasn't stable enough. And then we used a glass tank and I was doing pretty good on my own. And then Charles's ass wanted to be a part of my TikTok and he broke through the See what, what, the what it was was. I, on my foot. I thought it'd be funny if we both riding on the, the oh, little, it was funny. the broom. If you look at our last video and then go to the end towards the end, you will see like the actual clip. The actual clip that I got hurt in. Honestly though, we should upload this to TikTok. I thought we did. Uh-huh. Mm. We didn't really upload it, I deleted it. Cause I figured you wouldn't want to be embarrassed like that. But now that I think about it, people might actually laugh at that. <laughs> no, like for real, think mm. about it. No, people laugh at other people's misery. Yes. Oh my God. Yeah, so I have like, um, my foot's all wrapped right now. I can barely walk on it. Mm. But I'm alive. <laughs> I'm okay. This is really good. Yes. My back is hurting from arching. <sighs> We're in a different spot than we usually are. And honestly, I like the old spot better. I do too. <laughs> this is so uncomfortable. But the way this house is set up... Mm. <sighs> we have no windows. We have... Too much light in weird spots. I said we have no windows. It's just a weird. It's it's a weird location how where the windows are. It's not too much lighting. Everything is so hot. That's what we wanted. The food or he, in here. In, in. It, yeah, it's spicy. Um, I think we're wearing a sweatshirt. You want to know another surprise? That happened. What? Talking about the house. Like our like end of 2020 has been weird. Been weird, but tell them about the house situation. Okay, um, our house we have signed the lease to, to rent it, but they let us know the possibility that somebody may buy it. So that's what happened. Can I eat like this? Oh um, my god, this is way better. Is it really? Oh yes, I can go in now. Okay, I'm eating like this. Go ahead. This is 100 percent better. They let us know the possibility that somebody somebody may buy it before we move in. And if they did, we would have the option to wait at our lease. Because we were going to try to sell some lease anyway. Or, you know, get credit for a month's rent and then switch units. And obviously, y'all know, Charles and Lisa is cheap. So we chose to take the credit. And we got a month free. Over here. And we're in a completely different unit. Like, completely mm -hmm. different. Yeah. Totally different setup. Same like complex, is that what you'd say? Same complex, but different mm -hmm. setup. It's it's kind of like a downgrade, but not in like a bad way. It's just a downgrade in rooms. Yeah, cause we have three bedroom, three bath. Now we have a two bedroom, three bath, which is. Which is fine. I was honestly, 
when I first heard about it, I was kind of like annoyed, like, damn, like we really wanted this one. Mm -hmm. We really thought it was gonna be ours. We did everything, all the paperwork for it. Got approved for it. But then I was thinking like, we don't need three bedrooms. It's only us two. So it made it easier, low key. Because we were like, okay. I was just thinking like, we don't really need to be like, moving into a three bedroom. Oh, that looks so good. Guys, I don't mean to snap, or whatever it's called. Like this? Yeah, but. Some people like that. You gotta get me some shrimp up in. Ooh. The bowls make it like a little bit more messy, right? I like it. I like eating messy. I'm like, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I'm a messy eater. Like, mm. I'm not. A, I'm not the perfect eater. You know, so that's why I don't really eat out like that. I'm a messy eater. I think I'm more messy than you. We like to eat at our own spot, cause we like to eat our food how we want to eat our food. Mm. We don't need nobody telling us how we should be eating. No deal. But anyway, y'all, we have a two bedroom, three bath instead of a three bedroom, three bath. Mm -hmm. Which was completely fine, so. We still have a garage. Yeah, we got four car garage now. Four car garage. Well, <laughs> that makes it sound super like luxury. It's more of like two inside, two outside. Yeah. Let's make that clear. But the other one only had two. Uh, two. Yeah, I didn't have a driveway you could park outside. Yeah. The two bedroom does. What else does the two bedroom have? Oh, uh, the patio. Oh. Why are we talking so much? Because they'll see it. Okay. Guys, you guys are going to see it. The Stay patio. Tuned. The patio. You're about to tell them. Opens all the way up. <laughs> you know I can't keep secrets. Not for my people. Like those LA homes mm -hmm. where they open up from like the living room out, like flat, straight. Mm -hmm. I don't know. It's the best way I can describe it. This is like so hot. It is. Babe, how your knees not hurt? <laughs> my knees hurt. Mine don't. I'm occupied by the food. Like, my knees is hurting. I can't. Sorry, I'm not sitting like that. Mm. Let me get my chair. <sighs> oh my god. This is honestly. You want my chair? Yes. You want this chair? Yeah. Oh, I'm good. No, oh, here, take it. No, take it. No, I'm serious. <sighs> Um, honestly guys, thank you. We need to have two game chairs. Uh -huh. I mean, what was your, I gonna you say? Just for your makeup anyway. Um, mm, I was gonna say something, but I forgot. What? Dang, I forgot. I think it was about the new house. How much you can't wait to move and stuff? Oh, I know what I was gonna say. Uh -huh. This is the first mukbang in a few mukbangs that the, all of the food has been hot. Yeah, usually. So it makes it like 100% better. Yeah. That's why we're not talking as much, I feel. Because <laughs> it's like it's like heaven. Because normally be like a little bit of, some parts be a little bit chilly because we'd be having a wait and, mm. know, oh my God. This shit is good. I've never tried this before. So how do I open it? One second, baby. One second. Honestly, like, I liked seafood before I met Charles, but not like this. No. No. When you got with me, we became seafood... Junkies. Junkies, straight up. Oh my God. I need to get some good meat up in here. I've been getting like little. Mm. Well, I feel so nasty, but I don't mm -hmm. care. Like, I don't care. I need to look at my hands. Like, I'm sorry. Oh. Like, I feel nasty, but I can't even like. Like I said, I don't care. I, I'm the one that should feel really nasty. I'm still wearing the same clothes from yesterday. Cool. Come on. I'm terrified to shower. So she hasn't showered, guys. She's a nasty. Okay, she's nasty. I'm too scared. Well, the doctor told me to keep the area dry for two days. Yeah, so that I'm don't like, mean you can't shower for two days, Alyssa. Well, in my head, I'm like not showering for two days. No, you're not. You're showering. Her ass. 
Does that mean I can't Wait, shower? You didn't tell me how to get the meat. You're eating it. I'm not. Here, I'll my give you, I'll have give you no mine. Good meat. I'll give you mine and then you give me. Oh, that's good. Mm -hmm. Bless you, sushi. Okay. Take this lobster. Take that lobster and let Wait, them know. Wait, that's all you get out of this whole thing? Yeah. Take the lobster and let them know how you feel about it. That's all you get? Let me dunk it in the sauce. Oh, sushi. Dude. Oh, shit. Let the people know. Let the people know how you feel about it. Mm. Describe to them that feeling of that lobster in there. And honestly, wouldn't be good without the sauce. Really? Yeah. You don't like it? No, I like it. Ah. Oh. But I dipped it in the sauce. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it. Now, I'm like ripping it apart. I feel like I'm not getting all the meat, but. Nah, I think I'm my lobster piece. Oh, that's a good one. I'm gonna dip it in the sauce. And I'm gonna come up a little bit. Oh. Oh my god. See, I'm not like, I'm not cutting them good. I'm breaking them. Oh my god. Them. Good. Oh my god. Delicious. Oh my god. Is that the word you can use? Delicious. Fabulous. Outstanding. Magnificent. The best thing you've ever eaten in your life? Nah. No. No. <laughs> What's the best meal you've ever had in your life? Your booty. Girls. We're filming. I'm just joking. <laughs> I'm just joking. But, um, Best meal you've ever had in your life? Honestly? Or the most memorable? Most memorable? We used to eat sushi like every night. Mm-hmm. Dang, we did. Those were the most memorable. But then I would oh. say our first time eating Tams together. Mm. That's what I was going to say. First time ever eating Tams, I think I like. That was the best feeling. So Tams is like food. a Chinese spot. Honest to God. That food will put you to sleep. And it's like the best. It's like the best and it's so like, while you're eating it, you're just like enjoying like every, every bite. Like it's like amazing. It's better than this. Like this, I enjoy it, but Tams is like a different. A different animal. Like when we first started get we we haven't gotten Tams in a minute. Yes. But we used to always like post about it. People would be like, "Where did you get that food?" It's the best food. Like if you're in Arizona, it's fresh too. It's like fresh oh. Tams. It's T A M S. And let's get the shrimp fried rice with jalapeno wings. The best wings. The ba ever. by far the best wings. Like guaranteed they're better than like when you bite into them, the meat is just so like tender and like, You're ruining juicy. it because I want to go get it right now. <laughs> Everything about it is like bomb. Mm -hmm. Is Tam's only in, mm -hmm. yeah, okay, that's what I was thinking too. It needs to be more of like a nationwide thing. But then it wouldn't be as good. Because uh -huh. you know how people take over and like ruin your like recipe uh -huh, and stuff? Uh -huh. Just too fatty, just sad. Uh -huh. Honestly. Or they like change it up a little bit, it's not the same. Yeah, if they keep it homegrown. Keep it in the family. Keep it in the family, let them people do what they do. And let them expand. They eat good every night. Oh, 100%. <laughs> like every night. Oh, uh, they definitely if eat If I good. had someone like cooking me like the chicken that they make. Oh my God. 50 pounds, easy. I'd be thick. <laughs> 50 pounds, you gained 50 pounds. I told Charles, what were we, was it last night when we were like watching that home video and like the, what was it, house tours and the people come down and they're like, Karen, oh, yeah. make me. We were watching something and this lady came down and she's like, what's for lunch? Like to her chef. And I'm like, if we had a chef, you know how like much bigger I would be? Because the reason why sometimes I like miss the meals is because don't like I don't want to make it. She lazy. Well, if I knew I was a good cook, I'd make it, but I, I make it and it turns out horrible. Oh my God. If you get some, uh, if you get some. Uh, you all right? Mm. Some more water? I gotta get another water. 
<laughs> we should wear gloves when we do this. Nope. They like messiness. I know they do. Hold on, I'll be right back, guys. <sighs> Wash my hands. Mm. I feel like this is the messiest I've been with this. Mmm. I know a lot of you watch us eat because I get DMs like, oh my gosh, I hate seafood, but when I watch you guys eat it, I want it so bad. And I feel the same way. I watched this one girl, she's a mukbanger, a mukbanger, and when she eats seafood, oh my gosh, I'm like, oh, I want it right now. I want to eat it with her. We should have a meet and greet at like a crab place. Yeah. That'd be funny. But, see, the thing is, crab is ex kind of expensive. No, but have them, like... I wouldn't want nobody to pay for that. No, have it, like, a sponsor thing. Oh, yeah, true story. Oh, that would be lit. But we would be, like, not able to take pictures a lot. Yeah, because we would be, be messy. messy. And the conversations would be cut short, because... Everybody being there throwing down. No one would want to talk. about yeah, nice to meet you. We should do, like, a big <laughs> mug bang. And like have like a live Q and A going while we're eating. Mm -hmm. That's what B Love should do. Huh. B Love, B Love, B Love is like the best mug banger to me. Cause her shit be fire. How do you be a good mug banger? You gotta connect with the audience. I think I think one thing for me when I'm watching, you gotta be able to. I feel like I'm talking to you. Like I'm in your conversation. Do you guys feel like that? That's why I think we're good mug bangers. Because we literally... Oh, you think we are? I think we're pretty decent mug bangers. Oh, really? But we're not a mug bang channel, though. That's what I'm saying. <sighs> uh, our mug bangers do well because... Let me just square in my face. Heard that a lot. Mm. <laughs> our mug bangers do well because we talk to people. Like, we talk to them. I feel like we let them know what's going on in our lives. Like, who else will let y'all know that? Guys? We really do. We let you guys know everything. Yeah. Like, even... It's, it's so weird. As soon as we find something out, we go straight and tell it. We don't yeah. wait. That's why nothing can be a surprise with us. Like, for example, we could have kept this whole move a secret. Yeah. And then, boom, surprise you or something. But, like, we can't keep our mouth shut. Alyssa. You. You. We have a giveaway idea. And before even, like, really thinking about it, Charles already told you guys. Yeah, but that's because I don't like keeping secrets. That's true. I'm not a secret keeper. I'm pretty sure you knew that. Oh, I you know that for I've sure. I've known that for a while. Who's calling me? Who? Your, mom, <coughs> your mom's calling. She probably saw that video and she's probably freaking out. Mm-hmm. Because I didn't tell her. I was like, I didn't want to deal with it. <laughs> Let's call. Hold on, let me. Hey, girlfriend. I'm dead. She's still in the ER. Hey, mom, how you doing? I just was watching. What happened to my little girl? She's in the ER right now. Now? Yeah, they're working on like something about her foot getting amputated or something. I don't know. Shut up, Charles. No. I'm Sorry, mother. Oh, sorry, mother me. You both are in trouble. <coughs> Hello? Mom, can we call you back? We're, we're, in, we're, we're in the filming middle. right now. You're filming? Well, I want to know how your foot is. You don't have no nerve damage? No. Mm -mm. Are you sure? I don't want you walking. You have to heal and you can open up that wound and that guys are in the middle of boogie. She won't be helping move. We got it together. We gotta finish filming though. Shout out to Mama Ha. She's literally gonna sit right next to the phone until we call. Moms are funny. Moms are something else. That's how moms are supposed to be. So, honestly, babe, be lucky. I am lucky, but Me. you know, you know when you're on the pain, you're like the last thing you wanna do is like talk about it. No, too sorry. I really don't want to relive it, and plus, I had to explain myself like multiple times last night. 
One time I got hurt on the football field, my mom ran with heels on, jumped over a fence, and got came on the field. Mm-hmm. I was like, Mama, get off the field. And she was so worried about me. I did that with my brother. Yeah. In high school. That kind of like, my appetite. I can't eat no more. <coughs> I regret that every time I do it. What? I take like the head right here, dip it in the sauce and like squeeze it and a yeah. whole bunch just like goes to the back of my throat and it burns. You are, you are like a 13 year old boy. What? <laughs> Sit down. Nasty. It's a little nasty I see what you are. Mm. I'm going to save this for later. When? Tonight? Yeah. Yeah, I remember, man. Are you going to pass out right now? Yeah. Charles always? Yeah, I'm about to pass out. Hi! Bless you. Once this camera shuts off, guys. I'm going to sleep. He goes to sleep. Yeah, only because I got to take Benadryl. This, like, this stuff, like, legit, like, gives me hives. Like, I'm not going to lie, like. Everyone's gonna be like, you should need it, that. Yeah, I get hives, like, I'm, I, I, like, it's like I'm putting my body through trauma. But he don't care. But I don't care for y'all. Like, I literally, like, put my body through hell for, for this. That's why I do it for TikTok, and it'll never happen again. That's the last time I'm gonna try to do anything extra for TikTok. I'm sticking with the dances. I don't care how crunchy they are. I'm sticking with the dances. I'm gonna do the dances with it, because I don't care. You know, I don't care. As soon as I went into a different lane and tried to be funny, you got hurt. I got hurt. You ain't you ain't a comedian. Why are you trying to be funny? Actually, you tried to be funny. Yeah. You wanted a little taste of the brew, <laughs> and it got me injured. Who is this? Who is calling you? From, I don't know. Someone's calling from PA. <laughs> you gotta leave a text message, buddy. I don't know who this is. My number has been delivered to a landline number. Your current phone number? My text message has been delivered to a landline. Oh. Probably. Who has landlines anymore? Who has a, a house phone? You know? Who misses those days, though? I should. No, I do. I ain't gonna lie. I miss those little I had days. a Bratz phone when I was younger. I thought it was, like, the coolest thing. It was in the shape of I had lips. a crazy, crazy. I'm talking about phones. That's cell phones. Oh. Like I had a house phone that was connected to the wall and it was a brat style lip. And when you like lift it up, it's the top lip. Oh, I definitely had a, um, I was more wireless phones, you know, since I don't get caught. <laughs> what? Wireless phone. So I don't get caught. You don't get caught doing what? Talking on the phone late at night. How did you get one of those? A wireless phone? Yeah. My mom. I would, she. Oh, she, you didn't a cordless do it, like, phone. Key? Yeah, like cordless. Like I had a wire phone. And I would oh, plug up. Who'd you talk to in the middle of the night? You know, friends and stuff like that. Back old friends. This camera is so crooked. It is crooked as hell. Wow, guys, this is. We'll never do a mukbang here again. Actually, hopefully, the next time we do a mukbang. It's our new house. We're in our new kitchen. Alright, guys, well, this is the end result. I'm still eating. But I'm done. <laughs> Look how messy this is. Look at my fingers. Mm -hmm. Our camera got like came off the wall, so we just like, you know what? We're just gonna like be done vlog for style. Yeah, we're gonna vlog style this for the rest of the video. But honestly, that's it for today's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed a little combo, our little combo, little chit chat, or little life update. We'll be back with another in our new place.